Sade. I'm happy to see you. I must attend this ritual at all costs if I want to prove my theory regarding the transformation. What do you say? Will you come with me? I hope the Dunkus will not be too angry after seeing us there. Let's take some time to rest, and then we'll go back to the place where we met them.
you again. Your curiosity is truly unquenchable. Forgive our intrusion, Dunkus. But I really want to attend Yewan's ritual. I have learned a lot thanks to you, but I still have so much left to understand. If you were one of ours, Avra, I would be flattered to have such an inquisitive and resolute apprentice. You can attend the ritual, but promise me that you will be discreet. No Renaixe ever had this honor before. We will do everything in our power to prove ourselves worthy of your trust, Dunkus. You seem pensive, Dunkas. Not so long ago, our island resonated with the cries of the mothers weeping after their children were abducted. The young Sinal Manawi were taken often around a time of rituals just like this one. But these attacks stopped, and a lot of children came back home. I hope that peace has finally taken root in our new neighbors' hearts. Times really must have changed for some Renaixe to attend our rituals. These are very different from the others. Their leader is an Onol Menawi after all. I know I look like them, but I'm not one of them. You may not be bonded, but your parents must have been. You should be proud and happy about it. It is probably thanks to your bond that Donkas has accepted your presence. How are you? You must be feeling impatient. Impatient, yes, and a little bit afraid as well. It's only natural to be afraid, Yerwan. It's a new life starting for you, but I will be by your side, now and forever. Thank you, Dunkus. And thank you too, Dasade. Thanks to you, I see things differently. I now realize that the education I was given was incomplete. I was certain that thanks to science, I would be able to explain everything. And I was willing to do anything to find answers. Like my good master, Dr. Asili. You have nothing in common with that man. Besides, you had stopped following his teachings. Your interest in the natives never led you to abduct them, and even less so to dissect them. You wanted to understand, not destroy. Thank you, Dasade. I appreciate your thoughts. 